That's right, Erica. This one on New Jersey Street, the old O'Malley's, as well as the one on Michigan Street, the new one. Those two are on the list to be bought, but dozens of others are not on that list, and concern grows tonight for those customers. The tale of two marshes begins in downtown Indianapolis, where the New Jersey Street location made the list to be sold in the store chain's bankruptcy, meaning fears about a downtown food desert will likely go unfounded. That's really good news. I'm really happy to hear it because I choose the store. I say it's a good thing for, I mean, locally there's only there's a couple of marsh. That other marsh on Michigan Street is included in the sale as well. Court documents reveal intentions to sell 26 of Marsh's 44 remaining stores to one of two Ohio-based companies, Kroger subsidiary Top Valco or Generative Growth LLC. 26 of 44 means 18 stores did not make the list, including the Albany Street Beach Grove location. This is the only store that we can get to. Part of Jessica Pender's independence is driving her wheelchair to the marsh from where she lives at Beach Grove Meadows down the street. While marsh officials have not explicitly listed this location as one that will close, concern grows as bankruptcy proceedings play out. It scares me, you know, because, um, you know, as residents there, you know, we can't always get out and go where we want to, and this is the closest place, and, you know, the, the limbo is scary. And tomorrow is the next scheduled court hearing in these bankruptcy proceedings. In the coming days and weeks, we do expect to learn more about the fate of Marsh employees, as well as those 18 stores that remain unspoken for tonight. Live downtown, Chance Walser, RTV6. And tonight, some companies are objecting to the sale, including pharmacy giant CVS. They recently agreed to buy dozens of Marsh pharmacies for more than $30 million. They don't want this bankruptcy deal to unravel their investment. Late this afternoon, they filed a request that the sale not be finalized until terms can be made suitable to them as well.